For the research stage of our coursework, new technology helped us complete our project with ease. The internet was a vital tool because it allowed us access to websites such as YouTube, which gave us thousands of mudios in a click, which we were then able to analyse to understand the codes and conventions of a music video so that we could follow them in ours. It also allowed us access to social media, which we used to research the bands and their audiences so that we could understand the demographics and who we would be aiming our video towards. Final Cut Pro allowed us to analyse some music videos as we could import and edit alongside notes, which helped us to gain a greater understanding of the codes and conventions. The online blog WordPress allowed us to store and keep an ongoing diary in which we could upload each stage of development we made. It also, in whole, gives a direct sense of journey, not only for marking purposes, but for our own personal development. Initially, before creating the actual video, Final Cut Pro gave us the opportunity to upload our animatic, which then gave us a visual representation of what our actual video would look like. If it wasn't for Web2, we would not have been able to find such an abundance of relevant websites in our searches. Importantly, we wouldn't have come across Casemate, which was where we did most of the filming. During the construction stage, we specifically chose the Panasonic because out of the choice we have at college, we thought it was the best quality, easiest to control and gives a sharp, clear picture. In the editing stages, we use Final Cut Pro because we have the most knowledge of this program. This means that we were familiar with the controls and were able to edit and create not only quicker but with more successful results. Final Cut offers a wide range of effects which we took advantage of by using black and white during the band shots to distinguish the difference between characters and performers. It also shows that while performing, the singer is releasing his inner emotion, whereas in the narrative we've used sepia effect to show that he is restricted to hold back his thoughts to not disturb the equilibrium. The off-colour gives the impression that the reality is not all that it seems. During the evaluation stage of our coursework, we used many forms of new technology. One example of this is Final Cut Pro. Final Cut allowed us to make videos to evaluate our work. This is, more, this, is, this is a more creative way than we would have been available to us 10 years ago, where we would have had to make one script and put it all together in one, rather, whereas now we're allowed, able to cut up different clips and put them together, so we can make three separate speeches about each question. We also used Prezi, an online uh, presentation software. This allowed us to evaluate our work step by step and keep a good guide on how well we were doing. Again, much more advanced than the options available 10 years ago. We also used a camera. As, we've, as you can see from the clip in front of you, of showing us and how we were working throughout the project. Also, to record the voice, we've used a voice recorder. This has enabled us to record, record sounds and place it onto the computer where we are then able to edit together using Final Cut. As you can also see, we've been able to record the screen using the IMAX in the media suite. This has enabled us to show you exactly how we've been working throughout the project. In an easier way, rather than how it would have been done 10, 20 years ago, we've been able to just use, simply use an SD card that we can plug into the camera to record the footage. With this 32 gig SD card, we're able to record as much footage as we want without worrying about running out of space, and then we can plug it straight into the Mac to upload it and then edit onto Final Cut. This made our job much easier in terms of uh, 